Sexy, you ain't boo boo. <laughs> and I hope I didn't mislead you because I didn't mean to turn you on. Honestly, I can't even give you my phone number because sexy, you ain't, and I've had about enough of that. And don't get me wrong, you are cute. Your mustache, so trimmed and neat, sits right above your upper lip in a way that doesn't demand too much attention. I'm willing to bet when you're kissing, it never interferes. Plus, plus your teeth shine like they sleep next to the sun and got me wondering if they're really just porcelain veneers and the masculinity that channels its way into your throat and erupts in your voice could give ears gasms, but my muscles do no spasms for cute faces. My time is no longer free to be wasted on lies covered up behind handsomely hidden tracks. Therefore, Therefore, we are no match for each other. And it's nothing against you, it's just that you're not sexy. Not to me. To others, I'm sure, but to me, you're not it, boo-boo. See, the truth must be hidden in books not available in jails because they say that's the only time black men read. And though I still have a hard time believing it, I just can't understand why you ain't seen it or heard of it. Sexy has a brand new name and it's in his swagger when he walks. And if I didn't know any better, I would swear that the letters on the front of his sweater spell S-E-X-Y because he is so very so sexy, gives little of his body and lots of his soul. He steals hearts like a burglar with a rose in his mouth. And he's not sexy because he knows how to talk about giving up the best head that will make your legs shiver, your body quiver, and even your liver fluctuate from the way he delivers his tongue. Sexy gets you sprung on how hung his brain is. Sexy wants to know where your pain is so he can study, detect, observe, understand, take a minute, and then map out a plan to wipe your eye drops free and place them in a land where tears are buried. Sexy wants to get married. Sexy wants to get half of him. Sexy wants to give half of him to his better half so together they can make a whole. Sexy wants his rib back. Sexy wants total control. And not over his woman, but rather his life. Sexy doesn't spend his nights in knife fights, gun battles, and street wars. Sexy would rather be introducing car doors to the open stage for the queen who graces every front page of all the magazines that line up the shelves of his intellect. And see, baby, you ain't ready for that yet. It's nothing against you. Perhaps the memo is still at your secretary's desk. It just means to me you're not sexy yet. Cause sexy is a go-getter. He goes to get her from, her from work, he picks her up from school, and when it's costing him too much in gas, he makes a move that might make you think he's a fool and he goes to get her transportation. And not because he wants some sort of trophy to dangle over her head when they have their next fight. Sexy does these things cause he can't sleep at night if his woman ain't right cause that might loosen that tight bond that they share and put him at risk of being single. Sexy allows his heart to mingle with hers. He allows it to dirty dance with hers to the tunes and melodies of Frankie Beverly's pitch and Marvin Gaye's pain. But he's still very much a man. Secure in his manhood, he knows how to reel his love back in if that's what he needs to do, but he's not afraid to love his boo. And boo boo, that's just not you. You're cute but you're not sexy. You stand before me with your eyes openly and dressing me and your lips using subliminal messages confessing to me that the climax of your day will come if you could just hit it from behind. You're not ready to unwind in your bed with your Bible next to your hand trying to fully understand why Peter became a changed man. See, you are not sexy. You. You are just a young man playing in an adult's game, but my, the baby. Mama don't play chess when the kings are missing and my eyes play close attention to my eyes. My eyes play close attention to the style that you possess. Walking around like the S was branded on your chest before the doctor got a chance to smack your ass for you. I'd rather pass. I want to be open and free so when Sexy approaches me, he won't have to weed through the same rubbish as me just to get my concentration. See, Sexy birthed a nation and built a country on his back and he's prepared to do it all again but only on his terms. He accepts his gifts and doesn't fight with his faults. Sexy has a brand new name and it's in his swagger when he walks. Each leg walks with its own power, its own strength. Sexy's feet have walked a million miles in search of his true destiny, embracing each hurdle not as an obstacle, but as a part of his creator's plan to place him on the path of appreciativeness for his final win. Sexy fears God the way that I fear the hotness of stray bullets puncturing my skin. Sexy has a dream like Mr. King was reincarnated in him. Sexy doesn't sink, he swims. Sexy don't give a damn about no spinning ass rims. He's more concerned. He's more concerned with raising the equity on the roof he provides for his family's head. I love me some sexy, and we've never even met. But you or anyone else who can't hold a torch to his flame can forgive me dealing with your old ass lies. 
your women on the side, and your pride that ain't been swallowed since your last sip of Similac. So go buy a Cadillac and throw some D's on it. I'll be sitting shotgun, not in the back next to Sexy. His brain is on 22s, his intelligence wheels are always spinning, and his credit score sits on old school truths and folks. That's my brother, soul on ice. That's nice. That's what's up. That baby boy is sexy. Do us ladies a favor. Step your game up. Yeah.